in terms of life and death. I'm William Shatner. Tonight on Rescue 911, true stories of caring people who strive to the best of their abilities to change the course of events. We begin on the night of November 10th, 1989 in Desert Springs, Arizona, where Don Jeanson was overseeing a youth group camp in front of the church where he was pastor. Don's 12-year-old daughter, Susanna, was sharing a tent with a group of girls her age, including Beth Edelman. We were looking at pictures of all my friends. Even though it was late, we were all wide awake. Around 11 p.m., Don gathered the group together for a walk through the neighborhood. We went on this hike down this small residential street. It was a nice night. It was quiet. I just felt that everything was under control. My son Jeremy and Susanna both were playing kick the can. before me and under my breath I said oh no not my daughter not my daughter Come on. I, I just couldn't imagine how she could fit between the engine and the pavement there wasn't room for her I, I felt sure that she was dead I couldn't get to her I could, I could barely tell whether or not she was breathing. I said, Susanna, I'm going to stay here with you. Just let her know that I was right there. I feel like I should do something. Don called his wife, Diana, from the scene of the accident. I'll never forget the ring. And then there was Don on the other line. Hello, Diana. All I heard was these sirens, and he's screaming over the top of it. I can't hear you. Susanna was hit by a car. Nothing in your whole life can prepare you for those kinds of feelings. You see them healthy and happy playing one moment, and then you get the phone call. And you wonder, am I ever going to see him again, alive? When we continue, I didn't want to believe it, that a tragedy like this could strike my family. It seemed like I was in a nightmare and couldn't get out. <laughs> 